As the world's attention is centered on the terrorist attacks in New Zealand, President Donald Trump has shifted his focus Friday, at least according to his Twitter account. Trump expressed his warmest sympathy to the people of New Zealand in a Friday morning tweet after the White House released a statement condemning the mass shooting that left 49 dead and dozens injured, but then he moved on, issuing a series of tweets on various topics. Trump referenced a segment on Jewish people leaving the Democratic Party that aired in the 7A. M Eastern Time Hour of Fox and Friends in one tweet. In another, he quoted someone's suggestion that an Obama-era team was working to spy on him in 2015. As the world's attention is centered on the terrorist attacks in New Zealand, President Donald Trump has shifted his focus Friday, at least according to his Twitter account. Then, as the administration awaits the release of special counsel Robert Mueller's report into Russian meddling in the 2016 election, Trump claimed there should be no Mueller report at all. So, if there was knowingly and acknowledged to be zero crime when the special counsel was appointed and if the appointment was made based on the fake dossier paid for by crooked Hillary and now disgraced Andrew McCabe, he and all stated no crime, then the special counsel should never have been appointed and there should be no Mueller report. This was an illegal and conflicted investigation in search of a crime. Russian collusion was nothing more than an excuse by the Democrats for losing an election that they thought they were going to win. This should never happen to a president again, he wrote in three consecutive tweets. Trump had no events on his public schedule during the time of his tweets, but is scheduled to travel to the Pentagon later Monday morning for meetings with defense officials. He will return to the White House in the afternoon, where he will have lunch with Secretary of State Mike Pompeo.